as I think there's there's also other uh black topics that uh come up this week that uh are a cause for celebration of some sort. So I'm gonna play a clip first before we get into this next. I'm gonna let the clip segue us into this next topic of ours, you know, of of uh, mm. traditional black culture in twenty twenty four. Okay. <laughs> Don't call me, I'm on NCAA. God and Jesus can walk earth today. Don't call me, I'm on NCAA. My girl can get caught in 4K having foreplay. Don't call me, I'm on NCAA. My son can get kidnapped and it's a ransom they want me to pay. It won't be today. I'm on NCAA. My sisters can be homeless and need somewhere to stay. Don't call me. I'm on NCAA. My mama can need me to rush her to the hospital because she got stung by a stingray. Don't call me. I'm on NCAA. My best friend can get robbed and be butt naked on the freeway. Don't call me. I'm on NCAA. But in a relationship, I'm doing things the single way. I don't care if World War III started today and we all need to pray. Don't call me. I'm on NCAA. Now that uh pulpit speech was from the the good brother Haha ha Davis <laughs> on all social media platforms, fellas. Uh, it is the return of EA College Football 2025 this week. It, uh, as of this recording, it'll be out officially tomorrow. And uh, as as uh, brother Mikhail has uh, so eloquently stated on previous pods, there's just certain things that are go unspoken in the black culture. One of them being Tekken. Another thing being Madden. And then the sports game of of your choice that kind of falls in the in-between. Fellas, how do we feel with the return of college football to all modern platforms in this day and age? Hey, listen, all of my cousins are happy. <laughs> they are so happy. Because it, it was it's a it's a it's a weird void, man. Like, yes, you know, technically, um, you know, Madden gives that professional football. Actually, you can't even just call that signature professional football. It's just like there's such a connection to college sports. Um, just to, like just the experiences that we've had as young men. Mm-hmm. There is a there is a very big connection because when you really look at college sports, you see you. Yes. You see you. Mm-hmm. You see men like you see the prime of our youth. And I feel like it's that connection that delivers in the experience. It was it was a it was a void that was missing, man. It really was. Mm, yeah. It really was. Um, now, you know, I still feel the same way about sports titles, so let's just see how that goes for the long run. Right. If they say, like, hey, yeah, you know, we're going to just keep doing updates until we, like, you know, do some groundbreaking new gameplay mechanics. By all means, that that would be beautiful. But That would be beautiful, you know, honestly. It's, it's, like, it, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's going surprised. to sell, man. It's going mm-hmm. to sell. Mm-hmm. Just by the hype alone, bro. Like the day that they first released the trailer, like people were looking for their college, bro, their university. Yeah. yeah. They they was freeze framing every last single second. And then, you know, to be honest, bro, like even your girl is about to watch that because, you know, girls are big on their college sports too. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Like we all know girl, especially I mean, I even in my adult life, gators. Gators throwing up the U, like it's it's it is not a <laughs> it's not something where it's like you see like you said to your point Tim you sit on on the couch to turn the game on and now the girl walks out the room she'll be right there she's gonna oh, be right there <laughs> oh they got, they got in the game right oh they got in the game oh. hey you what, know what's what so this? funny <laughs> right after certain games are done you and your boys just gonna pop that on and then the party's just gonna ex- be extended by another yep. two hours bro yep. it's about fellowship man and that's what they want. That's what they want. So that is that's a one right there, bro. That's a seller. To make a to make a to add on to this point, we had a coworker um, at uh, you remember Lewis? Yeah, of course. He does not watch the NFL. <laughs> he watches college basketball. I mean, college football. Yeah, the college argument has always been that college sports are a lot more competitive. Yeah, like there, there's and, no more and, and the, the the polish. Is it's. Mm. <laughs> And he's like, you know, like, yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't care about that, man. <laughs> or is it the other way around? I think it's college. Yeah, he he cares about college. And like, for for everybody that I at least spoke to in my existence, they love college football more than 
they do the actual NFL. Mm-hmm. And then I enjoy when I used to play the sports games. I I don't care for them anymore. To Tim's point, because I'm not going to buy this copy over and over again. Yeah, just for this, uh, this glitch like, fest. This, but it's uh, a new roster, right? You could These, just uh, VLC downloadable. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep. Just that download. And then now y'all going to charge me for a Grand Theft Auto World to where we just play sports only? Come on. Yeah. The day Grand Theft Auto gets a football team. It's over. You can play football. You can you can sign up for it. <laughs> nah, it's done. It's done. It's done. It's a wrap. Mm. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right. I just yeah, no, yeah. I just I want to get your guys' thoughts, right? I think it's it's I'm happy, like, it's good. Like Tim said, like to his point, we all know somebody that's like, bro, they got a young CEO. <laughs> they definitely got a young CEO in there somewhere. Mm. He he had to, I don't know who he had to <laughs> no. throw, throw bodies over there. It's a new because it, it, it we don't need a college football. Are you sure about that? <laughs> yeah, no, honestly, to, to bro, it's a simple fact that, you know, EA has been taking a lot of hits, man. Mm-hmm. Taking a yeah. lot of hits. Like, to be honest, their last, I would say, success was Jedi Survivor. Yeah. And that's a niche. Yeah. If yep. you don't, like, that's a niche. So imagine something it's not that a is and play more game. of a general audience. Mm-hmm. They need this money, bro. They need this. Mm. And to your point, to your point, Tom, I think it, the long game we'll we'll see how it plays out, right? I'm like, if they turn this into another churning, right, the way they do Madden, where it's like this is a glitchy release every year, roster update, minor tweaks, is this going to fall apart like all all the rest of them do? Yeah. But I, this, if they, because like, like you said, it's going to sell. If they look at this as not just another way to print money and take it seriously, I think they could have another like hit. You know, like every company right now is looking for like, what's my next hit game that's going to be like. A guaranteed result every single time, critical reviewed, um, flying off the shelves you know, like back in the old days. I think this could be that for EA um, after their string of just like, what is this? What is this? What is this? Like to S Rank's point, I'm like Outlaws, we'll see, right? I'm like, I'm sure there's an audience for it. I'm sure there's some people that might enjoy it, but we'll. No, remember, in, in no, remember um, that's Ubisoft. Oh, right, 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 right. Yeah, right. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, I keep Lucky thinking that. Up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I keep thinking. Oh no, about, no, yeah, but, yeah. but but hey, it's the, but they're the same the same company, guys. <laughs> I'll do it for you, Lord Bison. <laughs> <laughs> and say, hey, put up the Bison, put up the Bison emoji <laughs> way, right next to me, please. Come on, it's 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 it's, it's, it's done. Yeah, um, no, I got more sound effects coming soon. Don't worry. <laughs> oh man, it is done, man. Mm. We, we don't even need to go any deep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a celebration. Let's talk, talk uh, positive. So yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah let's I, talk positive. You know, I mean, like I keep, again, like I don't think. Yeah, given how I know y'all, like I know we're not copying, but the energy is felt. We know someone who knows somebody who is copying this game, who has it, who got the ultimate edition, who was playing it two days early because college football is back. And I just wanted yeah, to, you yeah. know, it's uh, it's only right as a gaming uh, anime podcast that we highlight. <laughs> no, it's it's gonna it's gonna it's I'm 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 overall happy about it, man. I, I might even get back into it again if I feel like it. Um but mm. overall, man, it's um it's 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 and that's definitely because of money, man. It's definitely because of money. It's definitely because they they um they finally found a way to pay the players. So now yeah. it came back out. Which is fine, uh, right? I'm like it, which is it, fine. it's we live in a a a um a capitalist society, right? No, we're not. No one's doing this strictly <laughs> off, out of their heart, right? Not but, if anymore, everybody, right? but if everybody can eat, right? If, if the company's gonna make the money, the players are gonna make the money, and the consumers get a good game. Hey, I, well, <laughs> no complaints here. And, you know, like I'm not, you know, waving my injustice flag. I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys put out a great product, and you deserve to be rewarded with sales. So, yep. I'm glad to see it. I hope it it, it uh, continues the trend of them releasing games that people want now. Could we get an NBA Street reboot? I'd love to see it. Nope. But we'll see, right? We haven't seen EA Sports big in a decade. So it, it remains to be seen. Um, but all right, we can move on. 